Good morning, mustache riders. Conrad Zimmerman here with another daily run of the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. Looks like we got Maggie today. It is still freaking cold in New York, which I expect uh, expect it's probably going to have to be for the rest of uh, the winter. Woo. Let's see here. Ah, my computer's been a little uh, feeling burdened, I guess, this morning. So hopefully it doesn't cause any problems with the recording. Ah, oh, there's a new fish shark episode out. Um, it's funny, I was, uh, really looking forward to this episode turning out one way. It turned out a different way, which is, is fine. I'm pleased with it. Um, it's not the episode I thought we were putting out, but, uh, that's okay. Ooh, my future shines brighter. Okay. I don't know what that means, but thank you, Eden. Just clear out all that poop there. Oh, a, a completely empty room. It looks just like a start room, without instructions. It doesn't happen very often. Uh, 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 yeah, I was backing up there like, oh, you gonna get me. Retrovision. Alright. Let's do the rag, man. Skip it up, do it up, do it up, do it up, do it that's 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 my uh it's my little joke about the rag man it's like the scat man see that's how that yeah the jokes are funny when I explain them it's the sign of a good joke <sighs> One last little spider. Oh, come on. Stop running away. Damage up. I like damage up. Cool. Let's keep going. Right. Burning basement. Things went pop. Oh, those flies want me. They want me bad. But they can't have me. Because their AI or their movement pattern works that way. Ha ha. You wanted to chase me, but you couldn't because you can only move counterclockwise. There's a plane. In the background. I don't know if you can hear it. It seems really loud to me. Look, boss, the plane. That's a little Fantasy Island reference. Yeah. Tattoo. Shit, I'm not even old enough to remember that show without Malcolm McDowell, so... Ah... And, and Malcolm McDowell's pretty awesome. If I'm being, you know, while I'm all on the subject, I'm a big Malcolm McDowell fan. That guy is just, he does creepy and menacing really well. Grab us some money. Hi, hi, hi. I've also been watching a lot of Reno 911 again, um, which I, I love that show. Um, Really, as I've no doubt said many, many times in the past. Um, I don't have a key? No key? Alright, well, you know, I'm in pretty good shape health-wise. I'm going to go check out the punishment room over here. Maybe I'll get lucky and find a key in there. Pills, okay. Oh, this other pill could be bombs or key. Nope, range up, but I'll take it. Alright. So, I guess we're not getting into that fun room over there. 
Let's do the boss thing. Yeah, I'm looking good, looking styling. I like the horns and the white eyes. At least only he's burning, and there's no fire to set the other one on fire. That's good. Oh, Monstro, you're adorbs. Right. That just happy-go-lucky version of... The, well, the base, and therefore fairly mild version of bosses that I get concerned about. Right. Yeah, health's a good, I'm in good shape here. I don't, I don't know what the black sack is. I know the other one's the interdimensional buddy. Spin the black sack. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay, that's fun. That's a fun thing. We're going to play with that a little bit. Getting on with it. Whoa. Oh, God damn it, Conrad. Oh. I did it again. Why am I so stupid? Yeah. Solves that problem. Oh, there's a key. Cool. All right. Well, I'll get a freebie on this run then, or on this floor. Nope. I figure if he's gonna have to follow me anyway, might as well follow me and take damage. My kitty's meowing outside this uh, office door because I closed it. Yeah, you know what? I'm feeling this. Let's do it. Yeah, all right, cool. I'm happy with this decision. Oh yeah, that's an idea. Come chase me. Woo! Okay. Now these guys, I'll have to, like, take care of in a more traditional manner. You know, they're flying. They're, you know. Ha! Oh, now that was satisfying. And I got a soul heart in the end. Cool. I have been uh, absolutely, totally freaking hooked back into listening to Kennedy. Uh, Kennedy's a LA-based uh, producer, uh, sound engineer, and he's got a couple of albums. I've only heard the first one. I didn't even know the second came out, and I think some of it is retread material, but um, it's really eclectic. He's got a lot of different styles that he plays off of, and uh, there's some really like I got hooked in uh, as a lot of people have by this uh, new disco kind of stuff but there's some other really interesting approaches to, to party music in there um, and so I, I bought this album in like 2010 I think it first came out in 2008 it's uh, called Life is a Party and I bought it on Amazon uh, digitally it's like the first thing I ever bought on Amazon digitally because I was like well, fine, you know, I'm kind of over CDs now, it's 2010, I'm doing MP3s for everything else, and they say they're always going to have it available for me, so what the fuck, why not? So that's what I did, and sure enough, when I went to go download it yesterday, they did not still have it available for me. Uh, the album had been reissued two years later, and I know it, it was within... You know, it was, it was much later than that that I had been able to download these again, but uh, yeah, it had been reissued under a, uh, uh, a different ASIN, and um, <laughs> so Amazon eventually took down the, uh, the one that I had purchased, and it was no longer available. So I had to go through this whole thing. Oh yeah, I'm taking PhD. 
I do go through this whole thing with a customer service rep. Oh man, talk about a score. That's great, wow. If I can find three more cents, I might come back for that red candle, but I like where I am with my level of health and having the young heart there to help me out. Um, so anyway, yeah, I wasn't there. I spent a considerable amount of time with a customer service person. And, and the thing is that like in my first message to them, and this is you know, nothing wrong with them, they have their processes and so forth. Um, I, I, I listed, you know, the order number where I made the purchase, the, you know, link to the new released version, and, uh, and then they still had to, like, it took about a half an hour, I think, of, uh, you know, I mean, they weren't, who knows what was going on on there, and I wasn't really, like, in a rush or anything, it was a very passive experience, because I was on chat, I was able to do other things. Like, I, I'm trying really hard to make sure it doesn't sound like I think Amazon customer service performed poorly, because they, they were really, really helpful. Um, they basically just, it took them half an hour, but they credited my account, and, uh, and I just bought the new version of the album again. So, solves that. They were great. Uh, that's, I wish all of my transactions went that smoothly. And you know what? Fact is, nowadays most of them do. I think, I, I think that the uh, the effect that the internet has had is that there's so much competition uh, for your business that customer service uh, is it has to be good. And if it's not, you'll just go, you'll never shop there again because uh, you have plenty of other options. And even though Amazon is is kind of the behemoth there. They don't want to. They don't want to show weakness there. Um, so yeah, I was really pleased, really happy with my Amazon customer service experience. I'm just gonna run some circles. Oh, that's too big. Here we go. Just running little circles. Come on, guys. Come play in my playground. I made you a playground. It is full of toys. Nice. Oh, I, that's right. I got a bleeding buddy, too. Cool. I was actually freaking out about the blood. I wish... I wish the blood I left were distinct in some way from the blood enemies leave. Yeah. That'd be good. Hear that, Tyrone? That'd be good. Okay. What's over here? Ah! Yeah, I saw that coming. Nice. Yeah, I'll take the Liberty Cap. Sounds good. I like pills. Pills are good. Actually, I want to go back to that room for a sec. I think there were a bunch of clustered mushrooms. I might get a pill out of that. Oh, there's still someone alive in here. There we go. Alright, where was that? I don't like to waste time. Yeah, I can take advantage of this, maybe. Yay, a pill! Oh, a lemon party. Boo. Okay. Well, worth a shot. I won't do it for less than three possible mushrooms, though. That would just be wasteful, especially considering I don't have, like, a ton of bombs. Okay. Just gotta get these fucking worm bastards taken care of. 
Oh, there are two there. Sneaky. Ow. Man, I've got just I've got the ground covered damage wise. Yeah, alright, I'll take that. And I don't have the kind of money to choose the shop over a treasure room. But hey, got another key anyway, that's cool. And I didn't need to pay to get in here. Alright, so big explosions now. I guess we just go this way. Whoa, hi. Nice to see you. Hello, I love you. Won't you jump in my game? Uh. Alright. Um, hmm. Yeah, why not? You can have my five cents. This were nice. This were nice. Thank you. I was. It was nice of you. But yeah, I. I... Come on, open up. There we go. I don't want to be rude. He's a, he's a poor bum kid. I, he. I'm sure he'd like to, you know, provide really cool gifts. That's all I'm saying. I just, I, you know, I don't want to be too hard on the kid. It, it was fine. It, under other circumstances, I, I might have appreciated it more. You know what I'm saying? That's all. That's all. Nothing, nothing wrong with it. I'm making pentagrams. Okay, let's do this. The hollow. Mm. Do, 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 do. We getting paid. Gee willikers, Mr. Hollow, thanks. Nice, 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 nice. Things are looking good. Probably not on time, though. Oh, I forgot to pour myself some coffee. I need to do that. Not right, not right now. Like, probably after this. Hi, sword daddy. Uh, fly, fly away. Sweet bird of prey, fly, fly away. I won't stand in your way, sweet bird. If you knew the words, I know that you'd say. Fly, fly away. Sorry, I don't know what just happened there. I actually know exactly what happened. My brain just functions. It drives my wife crazy. Um, but I think there's something about memory in general and the way we sort of associate ideas. Um, I remember lyrics and dialogue and things like that. For whatever reason, sticks in my head uh, after only a couple of listens. And and obviously, the more I listen to it, the more I, I reinforce it. So where music comes down and music that I, I've enjoyed over the years, my God, there's, there's songs I haven't listened to in 15 years. I could probably remember all the lyrics to if the tune came up. Um, it's creepy and anyway 
<coughs> so this, this drives my wife crazy because she'll just say something that, as a normal expression, just, you know, in conversation. And my brain immediately brings up some, you know, 50s rock tune or a 90s alternative girl band song. And it just, and I, I can't stop myself from then singing it. And boy, she, she gets really annoyed. Uh, yeah, it's good times. It's good times. Let's see what's in this shop. Ooh, chaos. I can make my friends awesome, and I can buy a pill. Cool. Moving on. Yeah, I really wish I'd gotten some coffee in my throats. Feeling a little, a little dry. Where can I walk? Oh, I should use that yum heart. Yep. Since it's there. Oh my god, that dude just walked like that all the way to his death. How depressing. Yeah, I knew there'd have to be another greed head. I like the roofs with the spikes that go off. I don't mind that the spikes are there. I just hate knowing that I might have to pass back through a room again and avoid. It's just tedious. Ooh. Ooh. Do I want that, though? I mean, I like technology. How am I doing on time? Oh, well, I'm not doing a boss rush, so. Oh, that's right, and it's two, so. I mean, I lose some of my other tier speed, but. Yeah, alright. I thought that was two. Wasn't sure. Woo! What kind of car did I get? Alright. Better than a lemon party. Ooh, bombs. Let's do it, war. I also like that, uh, and I don't know if this is a glitch. Has you guys noticed this? Because I don't think it used to be this way. Uh, that laser weapons now seem to... And maybe it's just technology too. Maybe I'm remembering it wrong, but... I'm not obstructed from dealing damage by physical objects with the laser anymore. It's just something I noticed. See how it's hitting that wall and it shouldn't like, be doing damage to anyone? But it's doing damage to him? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. You're on the ground now, bitch. You're in my hood. Okay. <laughs> Did I take a damage loss when I... I must have. Yeah, I must have taken a damage hit with technology, too. Yeah, I should have thought of that. Going down. Down, down. Reminds me, I, uh, I was going through my old, like, cassette tape collection. Because, you know, like, I had CDs growing up and all that, but, uh, CDs weren't, the s weren't super practical when I was a teenager yet. Uh, CD burners, them, you know, like, home CD burners were really uncommon, and, um, I didn't get my first CD burner until... Until I was in college in 1999, so um, I had—I think I had a a friend that had one, um, and it was like a one-speed, and oh my god, it. Ooh, oh man, but yeah, so um, it wasn't—it wasn't practical to 
carry around, um... We made tapes. We made tapes of everything, basically, because we couldn't make copies of our CDs. Um, and it was so easy to damage the CDs that you almost rather have them on a tape, because the tape was solid. Uh, you weren't gonna fuck it up, and you could always make another copy of a tape off the CD. So, um... Found all of these old tapes. Um, and I'm gonna have to like listen to Gravity Kills again and see if that's actually still decent industrial music or or what. Because it's been so long, I can't I can't even I can't remember. Like pop industrial, it wasn't. This is all post pretty hate machine downward spiral uh, pop evolution of industrial music. So it's not like we're not we're not talking craft work here or anything. But uh, my expectations are still pretty low, is what I'm saying. Uh, my my interest in that type of mu music. Uh, eroded a long time ago, so I don't even know if I could make a fair assessment, or even make a, a well, an assessment of how stupid I was for having liked it. I don't know, I felt pretty dumb about Nine Inch Nails after a while. The early stuff. I was never that much into the later work, uh, which, none, no fault of it. I, I recognize it is layered and complex and it is interesting, but it's not something I would want to listen to, generally. Uh, oh, what? What the fuck? Not cool. Oh, I guess right. I got a ball of bandages, too. I totally forgot about that. Right. Devil the chariot. I'll take the chariot. What's that? No, that's my lemon party. Actually, I'm going to take the devil. It's a good boss use. <sighs> well, I'm not going to need a lot of keys after this point. I might get another one back. Hey, oh. We want that. Ow. Mm. Dicks. Some of you fuckers are going to start dying here. Yeah, I should not have taken technology, too. In retrospect. Now I got another less frequent laser. So that's something. Those come in really fast there. Now I'll go into the shop and probably fight greed. Oh. Blue candle. And a pill. I will take the pill. Ow. Oh, boo. I'll pick that up too. Why not? Okay, mom.
Okay. Oh, we're wearing it down pretty quickly, actually. That's good. I'm, I'm okay with this. Well, I guess I know where we're going. Good girls go to heaven. Bad girls go everywhere. <coughs> Why did I save, like, the theoretically most dangerous one for last? Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. Way to prioritize, Conrad. My god. I'm just gonna walk in circles. We. Yes. Excellent. That's, well, that was quick, simple, painless, one might say. Oh, heal that up. Heal that up. Ah. <sighs> yes. Yes, yes. Got a lot to do today. I have a lot of emails to respond to. Um, there's a new fish shark out today, actually. Um, that's, I, I have, that sort of tied me up a lot, uh, all of yesterday in some ways. And I can't get into how, but woof, it certainly did. And now I got a bunch of emails from people that I need to respond to because, like, I am all of a sudden becoming really, like, busy and having a lot of things going on. Uh, which is exciting, and we'll see how many of those things might wind up uh, happening. And you know, it's all really in a conceptual stage right now. But um, I am excited about things that could happen this year. Ah. Heal that up. Nice. Can't have it. Um. Yeah, I'm thinking we'll do the boss. Damn it. Oh, I hate him. Make it all the way around before he kills me. Jesus Christ! The fuck was that? Unbelievable. Wow. Well, so that's the run for today. It's the, what, 5th of January? I didn't even say that in the beginning. Oh. Wow. Really just... Wow. 